Hey, what's up guys, Elton here. Just doing a little storage run before I head out to go you know, camping for a few days. I uh, should be coming back Friday, so depending on how good it goes, my dad said it could be in the air, we might stay or stay longer, who knows, but uh, yeah. I uh, just wanna grab a couple things. How are y'all doing though? How are y'all doing? That was a crazy, that was a crazy weekend we had, man. That was very hot. It's It's been a hot week here even. Uh, it's pretty crazy, but um, yeah, I just started actually a new job. I'm not going to be working at FedEx anymore, so kind of crazy. I came back from uh, my uh, trip to see my brother and stuff and decided to, uh, well, not decided, but um, made a little career change, a little, little lean, more lenient um, at my buddy's shop in Concord. He sells cars out of there, so it's little in the middle class cars out of a shop. It's like a big warehouse shop. Um, we also do window tinting. Uh, if you have any curved wheels, we do that. Um, wheel painting, caliper painting, headlight restoration, all kinds of cool stuff with cars. So if you guys are interested in that kind of thing, Concord. <laughs> Almost, uh, down the street from Hurricane Harbor. So if you guys want a little hookup on that, um, I have a little shop out there. A buddy has a shop. So, uh, But yeah, I'm basically have my own little office and stuff. It's pretty cool. Um, sometimes it's nice to have you know good friends. So I've known this guy for 15 years. Uh, I mentioned him a few times in a couple of my stories of that on Instagram. He kind of reminds me of Jojo from Jojo's World. If you guys follow him at all, uh, he just has that character, and he looks like him too. So it's just funny. But um, but yeah. Anyways, we're gonna go grab some stuff for my storage unit, and then uh, see if I can get in there, man. Well, I can get in there, but all my camping stuff's like behind a bunch of stuff. So <laughs> but yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let's uh, get in the storage unit and find some things. Yeah, this storage unit is interesting because there is no there is no uh, <laughs> service downstairs once you go down there. And getting down there is a pain in the butt because you got to use Wi-Fi. And then there's no Wi-Fi. There's no internet once you get in the elevator. So here we go. Yeah, this is a pretty cool storage unit. I like how it's indoors actually I should have grabbed a cart <laughs> need to grab a tent um, my dad's got fishing poles and stuff so we'll do some fishing but uh yeah tent sleeping bag stuff like that so that'd be cool oh good nothing has fallen over <laughs> And the only thing that kind of sucks about this storage unit is there is no lights in here. I gotta get some of these battery operated lights for here. But yeah, all my camping stuff is all back here <laughs> behind all of this stuff. Yeah, if you guys are new around here, I uh, used to live in a house in Vallejo. No longer live there now because um, me and the uh, the old lady broke uh, split up and so I just uh decided to get my stuff out of there and move in, move out into my grandma's so I'm here for a little while until I get back on my feet but until then I have a little your storage unit I should probably get rid of a lot of stuff I got some old speakers and an air tank <laughs> for back in the day you said drag race and we'd uh deflate the wheat the tires and then put air back in the tires at the end of the track day and stuff and there's a bumper to my 240 that I'm currently restoring yeah bunch of stuff oh a towel warmer that's always handy especially when you come out in the winter and you have a cold bathroom <laughs> nice warm towel anyways <laughs> but yeah my TV a couple tool stuff anyways see if I can get this camping stuff out of the back here. <laughs> All right, so I just had to move a few things into the hallway. <laughs> car parts, you know, never can have enough car parts. <sighs> One of my first ever tool chests that I got. Of course, you know, I, this was 10, 15 years ago. Uh, who's a fan of Adams polishes? Yeah, I got that too. <laughs> oh, so these are the bottles I used to have or had when I got. Um, Five years of working at Coca-Cola. Yeah, three years. It's pretty cool. But, yeah, car parts, a couch, 
that I'm probably not going to use <laughs> when I get my own place. Maybe I'll get a new one. I don't know. A dresser. A bunch of random things. Anyways, all my camping stuff's right here, so perfect. Just got to climb over a few things. <laughs> my wheels. <laughs> oh, boy. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Found a little spot. Got all my stuff down. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah. Got some light. Yeah, okay, I got a little, a little uh, stove here that I use propane, or not propane. It's like a gas. I gotta get, I gotta get some gas from the, some big, from Big Five or something like that. And then, got a lantern. I got a tent. And then, uh, yeah, <laughs> bunch of random stuff here. Uh, there's another tent my dad got me a while back. That's kind of cool. It's got a, it's got everything in it. It's got a sleeping bag and. What else is that? Yeah, I don't know. See, oh, pillows. All that in one. So it's pretty cool. But, yeah. Yeah, just kind of going through some stuff here. It's kind of like a kind of reason why I stay away from my storage. It just brings back a lot of memories, a lot of emotions. Freaking like, you know, I'm sitting there thinking like 15 years, man. sucks I'm very I'm very fortunate you know to be where I'm at and just to have a place of my own not my own but my grandma's and stuff it's it's still weird sometimes you know just I don't know don't want to be a burden on her I know she loves me and my my family loves me and stuff and I really do thank them it's it's still still amazing you know but just got to keep pushing it's a big, big life reset to be starting all over. Still use some of the uh, things that my old family gave me. <laughs> I got this tent from them, and Steve, I don't know if you're still watching. Thank you, man. Appreciate him. And then I got, what else I got? I think I got this from him, too. So, everything that I got in... So, just like I said, just kind of brings back emotions, man. Life, life is crazy. Well, my dad just called me, <laughs> actually messaged me, and said he has all this. He has a sleeping bag for me. Uh, you know, we have a stove, stop, we have a lantern. So, <laughs> it was a, a pointless trip, but yeah, I organized it a little bit in here. Managed to move some things around, but uh, okay. Well, good to know. <laughs> well, I guess that's it. I came in here, thought I was grabbing a bunch of stuff, but uh, a microfiber towel and a pool stick that a friend Anthony gave me a while back. Since I've been playing a lot of pool lately, I might as well grab that. But other than that, <laughs> I guess I'll just leave everything behind. Well, it should be a pretty fun weekend, though. It's going to be hot. He says he's got some, uh, some blow-up mattresses we're going to use. And then put some sheets, basically, on top of the blow-up mattresses. And sleep on that, because it's going to be hot up there. It's in the 90s, man. But the lake will be right there. We'll have a boat. And it'll be... I'm sure the nights are going to be super nice up there. Lake Berryessa, if you guys have not been to Lake Berryessa. I've been there a few times, but never camping. Never camping, so... It'll be uh, really interesting for me, so I keep saying so, 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 oh my gosh. <laughs> but uh, no, um, it'll be nice to go up there with my dad. It'll be a different different tone, different kind of setting from what I just went through last weekend. That was the weather and just, like I said, the roller coasters I went through. But no, this will be nice. And then I'm um, going up there also, my, um, my uh, brother-in-law, so my dad's wife's kid, oldest kid. So that'd be cool. Go up there. I haven't, I haven't uh, hung out with him for a while. So it'd be nice to catch up with him and do some fishing, man. So it'd be fun. Hopefully you guys like those videos. It'll be a little series. So maybe like a two video series of up there. So um, I, th I imagine we're probably gonna get, I don't know what kind of fish. I'm not sure. <laughs> it's been a long time since I've even fished and even fished, actually been to freaking Berryessa. So, um, but yeah. 
<sighs> Life span, it's crazy. So yeah, my storage unit. Going up. Now this is a, like I said, self storage. It's not bad. They got like security cameras. They have so much access codes you need to just to get into the building, just to get to the to the floor or wherever I'm going. <laughs> so, and then yeah, so uh, and then every door has an alarm. So if, uh, basically, if you're not scanned in and someone else gets into here, it will trigger an alarm. So it's kind of crazy how this works, and it's yeah. What a night. What a night. All right. Well, like I said, it'll be a cool couple days. Next weekend, I got a couple things planned. It's gonna be nice. Spending, been spending a lot of time with my dad lately, so it's been really nice, man. Catching up with them, doing some events together. But again, I just want to thank you guys all, seriously, for all the freaking comments you guys left me, all the messages. Um, and a lot of you guys are, you know, you guys made some valid, some valid, valid points. It's been, uh, it's family, man. Sometimes you go through some rough times in life and you just got to get through it and push through it and be there for the ones, you know, sometimes they want, not, might not show that they want you around, but it feels good to, you know, just put put things aside, especially for emergencies. When you know, something comes up, it's like you know, I I can't go through something like losing you or knowing something that happened to you, or something that happened to you, knowing that I could have done something to prevent it. You know, so but yeah. Well, it's the next morning. <laughs> I kind of ended that uh, the night. Um, I got a phone call and then totally forgot that I was vlogging. <laughs> but anyways, I forgot to grab the lantern, so I talked to my dad and. Uh, we're gonna go and grab a lantern really quick, so yeah, let's go inside and grab a lantern <sighs> Hello, welcome back to your storage unit <laughs> oh, boy. Welcome back <laughs> Ah, There we go perfect Uh, anyways, <laughs> uh, this will be a fun trip though. So, anyways, we're gonna end it here. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. We're gonna get in the car, go home, grab some last minute things, and hit the road. All right, guys. I will see you, Barryessa. Hopefully. <laughs> Just waiting on my dad. I think he's gonna be in a little bit, and then um. Yeah, that's going to be our, our trip. So I'll see you guys in the next episode. I think it's going to be coming out tomorrow or sometime. Whenever I can load videos. I know up in Berryessa the service is not the greatest. But uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, the, the series. It's going to be interesting because I've been on this channel before. So um, it'll be interesting. It'll be different. So I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> going to see how I'm going to vlog this. Kind of how I did the, uh, the whole desert series probably. So... Um, I did do another uh, fishing video on my other channel, so it was a while ago, a couple years ago or something like that. We went and did halibut fishing out of Alameda, so that was a lot of fun. It was really cool. So, um, but yeah, hope you guys have a good day. Stay positive. Get through whatever you're getting through, and if you need help at all, I'm here, and I will definitely send you positive vibes. And uh, you got a friend here, you know. Um, I love you guys all. You guys are so such good people I was just messaging a couple of you guys on uh, messenger and Instagram and I was just saying like how how amazing you know I am seriously blessed to just have so many positive people that reached out and follow me on here and we're gonna keep that going we're gonna keep that train going you know um, you guys are all super nice so and uh, I, I am working on getting a, a little meat something going on I do want to plan maybe future barbecues at a park up here, maybe nearby or something like that. Um, I think it'd be cool. So, um, 
yeah, I'm just trying to figure out where and what time. It's just crazy hot right now to plan any of this kind of thing. So, uh, but yeah, anyways, enough of me rambling. I gotta get back to the house, finish packing, and I'll see you guys in the next one. All right, guys, my name's Eldon. Have a good night, or good day. <laughs> All right, guys, bye.